Hello, it's Steve from New Homes Historian. Today's video, we take a look at Gallius Homes, Darwin's Wood, just off the mount in Shrewsbury in Shropshire. Darwin's Wood is a selective element of three, four and five bedroom luxury homes. The show house we're going to look at today is the Rydale, a four bedroomed detached house. Hello there, it's Steve here and Emma from New Homes Historian and today we're at Gallia's Homes at Darwin's Wood in Bicton in Shrewsbury. Well it's the top end of Bicton. Well, this is the development plan that you're looking at and as you can see with Darwin's Wood you can see that a lot of the plots are sold and there's only a limited amount of houses left um, and Darwin's, Darwin's Wood is a development of I think there are about four and five bedroomed houses um, and we'll come to um, view the show house today. Now this is a very very select development um, here um, of detached, uh, detached dwellings so we're going to take a look around in the show house um, once we get inside. Just to say a little bit about the location, this, is, this development is the top end of Shrewsbury, uh, the top end of the mount, sort of on the Oxen area of, of the town. So this house type is the Rydale. Now you can see it's a beautiful a beautiful detached house with the um, lovely some lovely finials which are well known for galliers that sort of look that they've got and you can see that the detailing on the house is is impeccable from the the wave of wavy fascia boards the tiling um, it is a remarkable house and you can see a couple of the houses around the development as well um, so we're going to take a go and have a look inside well first of all let me tell you a little bit more about galliers Gallius Homes is a renowned Shropshire company that have been building houses for, since the 50s and 60s um, and due to a recession there was a few, few issues and Cameron Homes um, are obviously now the sister, this is the sister company of, um, of Cameron Homes as you can see um, and they've been building houses in Shropshire for many many years um, you know and they're renowned for their quality and their, their beautiful houses so Without further ado, let's take, go and take a look at this house type. This is the Rydale. So Emma, what can you tell us about this house type first of all? But I know as we come into the entrance hall here, um, you've got this lovely sort of um, L-shaped hallway. But right off to the right here, we have the lounge. Now. Normally I'm just going to take a look at the garden first. Now the garden is very nice, it's slightly raised as you can see with beautiful some sleepers there, really ample patio space, um, really ample patio space there, a very nicely landscaped garden um, which looks really really nice. So okay this is the lounge area. Oh, Emma what can you tell us? The room goes from, from the front to, to the rear of the property. Um, you've actually got four sets of windows in this room. So a whole wall of glass at that end, a large bay at the front, so for the, a little desk in which is well, I'm just trying to figure out, they are actually bifold doors. Yes, they which are really nice. I mean, they are full length near enough of the, the back of the house. And when they're open, I should imagine that just lets that garden come straight in. Beautifully decorated, very spacious accommodation. I mean, they've got two large sofas. The, uh, the use of lighting is beautiful. It is, and there's quite a lot. It is, it is. It's not short, and not short on light, is it? Do you know what else is nice is the double doors into the lounge. Yeah. Gives you an extra yeah. sense of space. There is, there is a, a feel of quality here. From Absolutely. you can see the the the. Um, Lighting sockets there, very nice, sort of. A yeah, it has chrome sockets throughout. Yeah, I mean these are obviously just options. These are that you can have with the, with with the house, but you know, you've got a mix here of of um, light fixtures and also inset lighting as well. Yeah. It is beautiful. I really do like this room. It feels homely. Yeah. It's, it's it does, a, doesn't it? It really does feel homely. Decorated. Yeah. It's beautiful, very stylish. And of course, with these double doors. 
gives you uh, gives yeah. you of this fantastic hallway. Yeah. Do you know I, I just I just like how it's I just like how it's furnished. Oh, it's yeah, it's lovely, I mean the it? newspapers. It, in actual fact it almost looks like Thank sort of know. things that have the people you know. It's not it's very nice. It's lovely. Okay, then so what we've got? Then we've got the hallway through these double doors. What's very nice about the staircase is you can actually see through there because the corridor actually takes you around. But you can see through because the stairs are open on this side. Wow. <laughs> which then takes us through into this absolutely stunning dining room. Great mirror. <laughs> I think it's lovely. It's what a great wow. idea. What a beautiful feature. It is, and I know I know that's not the show race trick. That that needed that, and that just it's it's it's, it's great, isn't it? Really yeah, fabulous. it really is. And we see a lot of dining rooms, don't we? Yeah, this is and big. And this is absolutely super duper. Yeah. A fantastic space. But of course, you haven't got to use it as a dining room because we will go through into the kitchen. There is a dining area in there, so this this room actually could lend itself to many different purposes, couldn't it? It could, yeah. Have a lounge, a games room, playroom, whatever. It it's is. Fabulous. And I love, I love the radiators are very discreet, and, and you can see how the, the, the um. Slightly lost for words there. The windowsill slightly protrudes out there as a feature, but also just makes the that blend in. It is. There it? is a lot of attention to detail. I mean, the furnishings are beautiful. Do you know the word I'd use? Sumptuous. It is. Yeah, it's beautiful. It is really nice. So back into the hallway, we've got a cupboard here. I don't know what's in here. Oh, oh that's a toilet. A downstairs WC. That's a cute looking sink. Yeah, that's isn't really. That uh, you don't need a big sink. I mean, that's, that's a little perfect. space saver sink, that is, that's isn't really it? Fabulous, yeah. But yeah, that's nice. So two different types of tiles. That's a nice detail. Definitely, yes. And very nice. I love the colours this, this is painted in. I do love how that wraps around almost that it's it that staircase is almost a fit a it's feature. A feature. It is, a it is in itself. It's and we need to comment on these doors, yeah, aren't they? Very the nice, aren't they? Which we don't want to embarrass the ladies, but it's a really useful cupboard for coats. But we should bear in mind that this this stuff that you have in a hallway. This is um this is a show house but also it's it's you know the ladies the ladies uh, and there is an open day today so there were people coming through. Yeah. So. Okay then. Should we do the kitchen? Again you've got another set of double yeah. doors equally the same size more or less aren't they? Oh, that's fabulous isn't it? It is. That just invites you in doesn't it? So it opens out into this beautiful dining area. And there's almost, like I say, it's a bit of a breakfast bar there, isn't it? Just mm -hmm. slightly recessed off so you can get some um, bar stools underneath it. Yeah. It is a nice so a kitchen. High gloss kitchen. You've got your wine cooler, which is just fantastic, isn't it? Lovely, uh, yes. The lighting underneath. This is a really, it is nice, isn't it? Oh, the colours are fantastic. They really do work, don't it's they? It's beautiful, yeah. isn't it? Oh, I do like these. Oh, she's got some very nice bread there. Oh, yeah. I love the mechanism on there. Oh, if they weren't plastic, I'd be having a nibble on those. So you've, got, you've got two ovens and a microwave, plenty of storage. This will be the fridge freezer. This is a fantastic kitchen. Now, before we go any further, Emma. Yes. Darwin's Wood, the development's called. Yes. What's the significance with Darwin with Shrewsbury? Well, Charles Darwin was born in Shrewsbury. In fact, just down down the road on the mount, that was the house where he grew up. So keeping it. And he went to school in Shrewsbury. What is now the big library it used to be the old school, and that's where Charles Darwin went to school. And what? Right, there you go. A little bit of local information so there. Just off kitchen you've got a living utility area that is nice isn't it actually it tucks around there some light flooding yeah. lovely little light in the floor the yeah the that's nice that it just gives that extra bit of light and a sink which i always like to see yeah so there's no door but it makes it easy to access no, i don't it? think it needs I like it that. but this is a really good size isn't it this kind of this dining yeah. area so as i said before in the dining room if you didn't want to use that as a dining room you've got more than enough space in here yeah
What colour would you describe that wall as? It's purple. Yeah, it's nice it's though. Nice. It's a very nice, nice colour, isn't it? Yeah. Very nice. Okay, so upstairs, upstairs okay then. Yeah. I do like the stairs. <laughs> they are very nice. Yeah. And here we are. We've got a L-shaped landing again. She's nice. I just love the layout. It's very Okay then. But if you look at the staircase, in a way it's quite quirky. Yeah, it is. But very individual, I really yeah. like it. It is, I think it is a slightly steeper than than most, but I mean it's getting it into that form there. Because yeah. staircases do take a lot of room up and that is really well done. It is, but it is the centre of the house. Yeah, it's a feature. Um okay, so the first door we come to is actually I think the family bathroom. So again, two different types of tiles. I love these tiles. I've seen these before. They're beautiful. I'm not sure what these stickers are that we've seen all around. I think they're giving you the options. They're showing you what oh, potentially see. optional extras. Meaning things are optional extras. Yes. So the tiles. I noticed there was some in the kitchen. Right. So That's we've got an idea, actually, isn't it? Now, how often do we see a pair of scales? That's really... <laughs> this house has been really thought about. Everybody has them. Whoever's designed... Whichever designer has done... Has, has worked on this house has thought... Is actually in touch with, with yeah. what a house should be with these little bits and pieces. But anyway, going back to that, we've got ideal standard sanitary ware. Very nice. Yeah. And the doors continue upstairs. Very nice. Lighting, which is yeah. really nice. So through into what I think is probably the master bedroom. I yes. Really good size bedroom. It is good. You know, you've got so much space around the bed. Two good size yeah. pieces of furniture. Well, obviously, this room is above the lounge, which which goes from front to back, doesn't it? Yeah. So you've got the same size as you've got in the lounge, which did seem really, really substantial. Did yeah. So this is a super good. Size Just on a quick look at the garden, so yeah. you can see that we've got a beautiful garden, lovely round deck in there. It is. It's nice. It's nicely mowed. It's it's nicely a lot. Look, a lot of um, bark just to keep the weeds down. You know, thinking of low maintenance. So very nice features. Yeah. Feature planting as well. So it's very nice indeed. So a wall of fitted wardrobes. Very nice. Do you know? I like the black. I like it. It is. It's very nice. Plenty of room for additional storage. You could even have a much bigger bed in here if you wanted to yeah i mean i'd say that's a double you could fit a, a super king size in here there's plenty of room really lovely wallpaper as well so it's got an ensuite and the lovely planked tiles i like these very the much wood effect, yeah yes, they are these very are nice. really gorgeous yeah that's a big shower, isn't it? It is, and you've got a little bit of a room there for a little bit of a unit or yeah, something in there. The but yeah, let's look at the shower in a bit more detail. You can see you've got, you know, the big shower head and the little one for... Oh, it's a very nice, isn't it? Very well thought out house. Very nice. Very nice. Very nice. Very nice. Very nice. Very nice. So yeah, there's not many houses I view that, that I really like. Do you know what I'd say? Not really like, but really connect with, with the layouts. And this is one of them I really do connect with this. It's a beautiful house. So a smaller bedroom, but still a really good size. Done in a young man's sort yeah. of style. Yeah. And they've got a single bed and some freestanding furniture, but a really lovely room, isn't it? Going for a bit of go-kart in there, good lad. Okay. So another double bedroom at the rear. Wow, that light fitting, look at that. Lovely. Oh, it? that's big. Really beautiful. It is, it's paper, it's like a... It's a very pretty room, I like this. Lovely bed. Lovely bed. It is, this is actually a nice. <laughs> but it's a good size room again, yeah. plenty yeah. of space around the bed. Very nice. But you know, the light fitting is very nice, isn't it, above? And I think to date, we, to date, this is probably one of the nicest houses we've viewed in Shropshire. Do you know the detail is nice there above the wardrobe? Yeah. So you've got a bit of light in. I don't know, it's sort of very well thought out, isn't it? It certainly is. Yeah. 
just to let you know that there are other people in the house at the moment because yeah. this is a, a working show home. It is. Mm. So another very big bedroom with an ensuite. Yes. Again, it mirrors the layouts really nicely mirrored downstairs, isn't it? This is over the, the beautiful yeah. dining room. And don't it? forget you've got a big double garage in with this yeah. as well. The, the, the garage is the other side of this, isn't it? Yes. The wardrobe. So we've even got an even bigger bank of wardrobes in here. Do you know, I think these actually might do for us. Yeah. That's the sort of... <laughs> This is how much storage most couples need. And the glass is very, light, very lightly smoked, isn't it? Is, it? Yeah, it's kind it's of, very nice. Yeah. It's really... One, two, three, you've got five doors. I think that's probably the biggest wardrobe we've seen. Yes. Well, in but, the, I, the in it, but even so, even though that's there, it doesn't really take away from the space, does it? I love that headboard as well. Yeah. It's almost like a 3D headboard. It's a <laughs> I like everything in here. And I love the picture of the elephant on the bedside table. Yeah, I wonder what's the relevance with that. What have you got on your side? Uh, giraffes. Right. <laughs> okay then. Yeah. We've got this lovely... Beautiful life. Yeah, the, yeah. and again, the, news, the newspaper's there. Yeah. Um, let me just have a look on the date, because we are quite quirky like that. Um, we're looking at December the 16th, 2014. Okay. Old news, though. <laughs> yes. The newspapers make be old old news, but this is not. Beautiful, isn't it? It is. And it's got a lovely ensuite as well. Yeah, so again, the purple theme is carried through, and there's there's hints of that in every room. It is, yeah. So very consistent colour scheme right yeah. through the house. It's lovely, and you know, in here, very simple white tiles, but with the chrome edging. It lifts it, doesn't it? Sets it sets it off, yeah. 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 Beautiful. It does. Okay, that's what's going on, dude. So. Well, for see. our first review of a Gallia's house, um, I don't think we were disappointed. I, I, I think it's, Super you know, nice. it's got a very, very traditional house that look about it, like houses used to be built, you know. And, and this house will stand the test of time. Yeah, exactly. You know, and it's you, there's a lot you can do with it. it. You know, in terms of the rooms, I think it looks beautiful from outside. It's a beautiful, lovely, traditional looking house. And the development as a whole, I would say. Yeah. This is being added to an already very beautiful development. We are going to take a look at the development in a minute, um, at some of the house types that are available, um, where, where possible, um, and take a look at the location, but overall the house is fantastic, isn't it, you know, and, you know, equally stands shoulder to shoulder with a lot of other developers, and I think this is a very nice house. And we would advise anybody to come and take a look? Yep, yeah, yes, I mean, um, uh, you know, yeah, yeah, and, and it's worth noting about the Gallias Hub in Shrewsbury at Bellstone. They've actually got a little office there, which is uh, quite unusual, but but a great marketing marketing hub. Um, and going there and look at a lot of the other developments that Gallias have to offer in Shropshire. Mm -hmm. Thank you for watching. And look out for more new videos coming to our YouTube channel soon.